You know, I've been doing this a long time now. I've been making crypto content on YouTube for right at two years. May is actually the anniversary for me to be in crypto here on YouTube. And I've loved every minute of it. Uh, it's been some <laughs> crazy times. Uh, but I tell you that only in the context to give you some context for what I'm about to say. I have built my channel on community meme tokens, Dogecoin, Shiba Inu, and I've covered those uh, for two years. And so I, I wanted you to get the fact that when I tell you that this is a community meme token that I'm about to tell you about that will stand the test of time, I really mean it. Now that's my personal opinion. Okay. On also full disclosure, I am a partner with this project and it is Suka. And uh, I have bought my own bag of Suka and I plan on holding because I think that this is one of those standout community meme uh, token projects with a massive, um, you know, community behind it and 100% driven by the community, the dev uh, initiative, the utility, it's all coming from the community. And I love that. And so I just wanted to stress that to you. So I've got a few things I want to show you real quick. And uh, so all links in the description below will be to, to everything I'm about to show you so you can go check out Suka for yourself. Okay. So like I said, I wanted to kind of show you real quickly, okay, this. So on uh, CoinMarketCap, you can look at the meme token category and you can look at the big ones. Now, you obviously, we got Dogecoin, SHIB, Pepe. Uh, Pepe's come on strong as of recent. We all, we all know about Pepe. But then you got Floki. Obviously, Bone is part of the Shiba Inu ecosystem, Dogelon, Baby Doge, and then you have Suka. Suka is absolutely one of the top 10. Right now, currently with a market capitalization of about 51 million, it's been, a, it's been higher. It's been pushed down and moved down. Uh, let me show you the chart because of kind of the overall, everything that's been going on with the overall market. Now, Suka itself, let me show you this right here is up right here where this is highlighted is up 22% right now. So it's actually doing, doing pretty well right now. Okay. But like I said, I want to show you this chart, the very charted chart um, kind of tells the, the story of time in the context of, you know, kind of what, you know, of, of what's going on, by the way, Suka is one year old. It was launched in May of 2022, uh, which was arguably one of the worst times to launch a project. And it became a safe haven to a lot of people that were looking for a place to kind of land from all of the carnage that was in 2022, when the entire crypto market went down from 2.7 trillion to 700 billion, lost two plus trillion, that's with a T, two plus trillion dollars in market capitalization, in the entire crypto market. But you can see that again, Suka is weathered and stood the test of time. And that's actually a really good point that I want to make. Suka has withstood a major, massive bearish cycle that was the remainder of 22 and the first part of 23. Okay. And a lot of community meme token projects can't say that. And it's one of those really key things that you need to be aware of is that, Hey, does this project at, you know, insert project name here, has it withstood a bearish cycle? Can it withhold and, and, you know, withhold, uh, not withhold, but can it withstand, right? Can it withstand those times? And so again, I wanted to make a real quick video for you. I didn't want to talk, you know, give you all a bunch of other stuff, but I just wanted to really stress this to you is that, um, I'm holding, I have bought Suka. I'm holding. I think that there's some great things coming. And I think that when we get back into more positive times, it's going to do well. And by the way, again, just to show you that chart, the chart still looks pretty darn good. And look, look at, look at the baseline where it's held here. I mean, where my cursor is, it's bought it. It's hit its bottom and it's, it's hit its bottom one, two, three times and bounced up off of that. Okay. It has withstood the test of time. And remember, this is a one year plus project. So this chart you're looking at is a long time, right? And if you look at it right here, see, this is where it launched. Like I said, it launched in May and you can see it, this is a, you're looking at a one year's worth of a one year chart that tells some pretty interesting stories, some high highs and some lows, but it is again, bounced off its lows. And we are right now, um, as you can see, you're on this, on this, uh, chart right here, we're bouncing off that low and coming back. So just food for thought, run it through your own due diligence, all links in the description below to, uh, check out and learn more about Suka. All right. I'll see you. Bye.